So I have something to say about circumcision and religious freedom. Now, of course, being a men's rights activist, I'm also an attacktivist, which means I am against circumcising babies for no reason. And one of the pushbacks that I get is freedom of religion. If you ban circumcision, then you are infringing upon people's religious rights. But I think that's kind of thinking about it backwards, because when you circumcise a baby, it's permanent and irreversible. And what if that baby grows up as an adult and converts to a religion where they are uncircumcised? Now you're making it impossible for that adult to fulfill the body requirements of that religion. So that's why I think it makes so much more sense to make the age of circumcision 18, because then a person can make a choice to do the ritual and really commit to their faith if they want to. Or if they want to remain intact and they don't want to slice off the majority of erogenous tissue, because why would you, then the choice has not been forced upon them as a baby. So when people talk about religious freedom and circumcision, I actually think it's the other way around. You're taking away someone's religious freedom from their adulthood. 